The small business owner pivoting to plants in the pandemic, moved by the healing power of all things green. And now she's sharing that magic with others in New England's first black owned plant shop. Caring for plants is so beautiful because you get to watch them change and grow and morph. There's nothing like taking care of something and watching it flourish. So Emerald City Plant Shop is New England's first black owned plant shop and botanical event space. We have a variety of different plants that we sell at our shop. We've done movie screenings. We showed the Little Shop of Horrors for Halloween weekend. We work with a lot of local wellness professionals. We have tons of cool plant gifts for all the plant people in your life. The look on people's faces when they enter the shop. This is part of the reason why I opened it. My love of plants started way before I even knew it was a thing. When COVID hit, I was furloughed and had no idea what to do next. Just being in isolation over the pandemic, I deepened my love for plants. Mental health is very much top of mind, especially now. And caring for plants really helps you in turn care for yourself. Have you watered your plants today? Well, have you drank any water today? You know, are you getting enough sunlight? We're just complicated house plants. That's really what got me through COVID, especially as, you know, a person living alone. I started my business, Q Made It, specializing at the time in vinyl record crafts, but I had a pop-up opportunity in December of 2020. I took that as an opportunity to kind of pivot into going into plants because I saw just how crazy people were about plants. And the number one question I got was, where are you? Where can we support you further? And at that point I had no idea. And so I was like, stay, stay tuned. Pot and plants, yeah. we pot and plants. Business has been amazing. I love this job because it's amazing to be able to spread what you love and have it catch on and have people make it their own. It is my personal goal to get everyone in my life to have at least one plant. Something so simple as like a $5 plant can just sometimes change your day around. Like a year and a half ago, would I have thought or believed that I'd own New England's first black owned plant shop? I'd be like, what? <laughs> That's just a testament to doing something you love authentically and passionately and never giving up on it. It's amazing what you can do when you kind of don't take no for an answer. We were just talking about TJ's green thumb. Yeah, I have a plant apparently, you tell me you can't kill it. He said a snake plant. I'm like, yeah, you pretty much cannot kill it. It's, it's doing a, it's well. It's a smart first plant owner's plant. Smart first plant, <laughs> okay. It's doing well, I will water it today though. He said he hasn't watered it in three months. <laughs> but it's still green, it looks Can't fun. kill it. Okay. <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.